we as Christians sometimes look at our efforts of studying scripture, praying, and going to church as our own way of earning our right standing with God. What a sobering reminder the most holy and solemn day of the Jewish calendar is, the Day of Atonement. Unlike other feast days, this is not one of celebration, but to cease work fast, confess, and pray. In antiquity, the high priest followed a strict routine of washing an animal sacrifice to atone for the sins of the people. Only by these rituals was he permitted to enter behind the curtain of the tabernacle and later the temple to enter the Holy of Holies in the presence of God. The curtain separated God from man. Just as the Jewish people couldn't assist with the messy work of atonement, Christians must accept Jesus and his sacrifice to free us from the grip of sin and death. Matthew 27 51 says when Jesus died, the curtain of the temple was torn in two from top to bottom. Jesus, our perfect high priest and atoning sacrifice, removed the barrier between God and his people and ushered in a more 